Hey guys, welcome to Dulabic Studios review videos. I'm your host, Boyan Dulabic. So today I'm going to review the Nexus 4 uh, wireless charger. So I bought this guy quite a few months ago and um, I like it. So let me tell you why. Now, first of all, this is it. Take this guy, take your uh, Nexus 4, put it on this uh, little plate and it charges it. And it's literally that simple. There's no, there's no setup, there's no software to install or any of that stuff. Pros, it's wireless. It's not as expensive. I mean, some might argue it's, it's about 60 bucks on the Play Store. But here's the thing. If you want to get any decent um, USB um, you know, dock, USB cradle, whatever you want to call it, you're going to have to pay uh, 30, 40 bucks around there and it's not going to be wireless you're still going to have to dock it and all that so considering all that this is really not that much more now the negative is this sucker is a magnet for dust now you can't really see it on here um, but um, it really collects dust like crazy so that's a bit of a problem and also it's hard to get it off of this surface you can try to scrub it off but it's very difficult to get it off so you know it after a while and I've had this now for um, four or five months for sure you know it, it starts to collect dust and it doesn't look that great so that's a bit of a downer you know um, and also another downer um, because the way it's shaped which is it's uh, it's you know like a half of a cube so you can see it right there and uh, so the way that works when you Put the guy on there sometimes uh, even though it it does hold its position because of the magnets um sometimes it does happen that when you put it down it doesn't charge it so i guess you know you didn't hit the uh, the proper position for it to charge so i have noticed a few times when i put it down because normally when you put it down it makes a little beep and then you know okay it's charging it and sometimes that didn't happen so I had to slightly configure it not always but it does happen sometimes so that's um, you know that can be a bit of a downer because the last thing you want is waking up in the morning and realizing your phone is not charged at all because my phone is my everything my GPS my everything so I need that sucker to be charged and ready to go uh, charging time also takes a bit longer than your regular USB cable um, but I found that you know in five 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 and a half hours usually uh, you know it does go from NT to full and I uh, haven't had problems there but it, it is a bit slower when it comes to that um, so you know that's pretty much it um, this is the box it comes with uh, the cradle itself the USB cable like I showed you here and the um, little converter and um, I would recommend it because I'm a, I'm a bit of a organizational freak so I hate cables I I, just, I can't stand it and this does get rid of the clutter you know you still need to have the cable that goes from this guy to the wall obviously but you know you can hide that away and um, it's fine you know I've, I've seen reviews where people say it's too expensive it's not good blah 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 and you know those are valid reasons but to me I like it I think I mean yeah I, I wish maybe you know it could be 10 15 bucks cheaper um, but um, still overall I definitely recommend it and I would say buy it so that's it for now stay tuned for the next one Hey guys, if you like this video, feel free to check out some of my other videos and check out my other shows in this channel. And if you like it, subscribe.